Um, I want to do a real quick uh, lesson on beginner chords. Um, the very first chord actually probably would be the hardest one out of all of these, but the very first chord is a G. And you want to take your middle finger and put it right here on the third fret, right there. Yeah, it's one, that's right there. And then right behind it, you take your index finger and you want to put it right here. And that's on the second fret of the fifth string. And then you want to round your fingers out like this and then take your third finger and put it on the third fret right here. And then your last finger, which is your pinky, put that right here on that fret. And it should sound like this. So, the, uh, so middle finger, third fret. Um, index finger, uh, second fret. These two are open. Those are the, the D and the G strings. They're open. And then on the third fret, have both of these two fingers like this. So you'll get... See that? Um, and then that's... Uh, the next chord is just going to be... Everything is going to be open. All the, all the, all the uh, strings are going to be open, except you want to press down on the um, second fret and uh, on, on both the A and the D string. These two here. So these two, this string here, the A string and the D string, you just want to take these two fingers and press down on them in order to produce that noise. So you got, and then for the next chord is a C. You want to take your uh, index or your ring finger, put it here and right behind it, take your, your uh, middle finger and put it right there. And then you want to take your index finger and put it right here on the first fret on the B string. So then you're going to get this. And it's good to also use your finger to this finger here to mute this top string. You don't want it to be like, you don't want it to be ringing out. You just want to mute it as you're pressing down like that. So that's how that chord goes. And then the last chord is the D chord, which you're going to be playing only the last four strings, D, G, B, and, a, and E, but you want to have the, an open D, and then you want to have your uh, index finger right here on the second fret, ring finger on the third fret, and then your middle finger on the very last fret here on the, on the E string, and it will make that noise. So all together you have this chord, this chord, this chord, and this chord. And uh, the strumming pattern for those chords uh, for this particular lesson will be down, down, up, up, down, up. So. And that's the whole thing. So you just play the song. basically everything. <laughs>